My name is Sophie Horlock and I'm the current school captain at the Cathedral School for this year. I came to the school in Grade 7. What I enjoy most about the school would be the house tutor system that we have. Because of its relatively small population of the school, we're allowed to form close bonds with students in our grades, students in other grades as well as the teachers. I think an event that really illustrates the essence of the school would have to have been the house musical competition that we had just recently and we compete in our houses and at the end this year we had our surprise centenary flash mob. Cathedral is the sum of all parts that all the teachers contribute to the success of students and the success of the school. Mr Triffitt, he was my year nine English teacher. Although I was petrified of him at the start, he was probably the first teacher that pushed me academically to be my best self. He would never tell me anything was good when I would hand in drafts and that really taught me the traits of editing and proofreading which has really helped me. I'm really grateful for what he did with me in year nine. It's an honour to be school captain any year, but particularly to have it in the centenary year of the school, I'm really grateful and I hope I'm doing it justice. <laughs> I think there's definitely an acknowledgement for the centenary events. It's really evident with participation in events, like from inter-house dramas and musicals, there's like a real high energy of participation. What I'm looking forward to the most this year would be the Foundation Day service. I think that will be a really special moment for the school. The school will definitely grow with the times, but Cathedral's one of those schools that you could walk into years later and you'd be like, yeah, this is Cathedral. It's had that essence, those core values for the last 100 years through changes of principals and students. I have no doubt that it'll continue to be the same for the next 100 years. I'm Harrison Lascelles and I'm the current school captain. I'm a board at the school and the reason I came here was for the many opportunities that the school has from arts, academia, sport. And I've been in pretty much every football team from 15s to Opens now. So we're looking forward to our UK tour which comes up in September, which is really exciting. I know I haven't been overseas, really looking forward to that. For me, it's just the friendliness of everyone around, the staff, the students. There's such a great bond between everyone and everyone really looks after one another. The whole week where we say goodbye to our Year 12s, it's just such a memorable occasion with all the events from valedictory to guard of honour and borders final. Being the school captain in the centenary year, it's a very humbling honour. It involves a lot of responsibility and great fun. What I'm looking forward to about the centenary events is, I guess, seeing the new facilities. The Lagoon project looks really beautiful. Just seeing the past students, the history of the school, everyone reconnecting after the 100 years to celebrate. I know in the future it's definitely going to hold the same underlying values that the school has today. Really caring for each other, looking out for each other, educating for lifelong success. It will all still be there and it will still be one of the best educational institutions in Queensland.